If you would like to maintain your transfer pump, firstly, you need to take off the top part of the pump. You need to unscrew the numeric part with the help of two metal bars. I will show you the throat seal in here. Unscrew the parts and you can see them in here. You need to take off the suction hive of the pump horizontally. Be sure that the suction ball is moving like that. These are the throat seals that you need to change. After that, we need to take off this metal pin. This is the metal pin and this is the pneumatic head. Take off the shaft from the bottom and these are the felts that you need to change. You need to take off these springs. After take off the spring, you need to take off the metal pin. And do the same steps for the other end. These felts might have some damage on the surrounding. Take off the head part from the body. We will have single body and we will just need to change these two O-rings. And we are done with this part. And we need to take off the air hive of the pneumatic head. Take off the protection spring of the air hive. These are the throat seals.
What we need to change is these throat seals. To change this felt, we need to take off this screw. Replace this felt with the new one. I will separate these parts by take off this screw and you can reach the felt to change it. And we will continue with this pneumatic head. Take off this three screw. and take off this cover you need to take off this screw as you see take off the other plate and get the small parts and we have some extra oil and you also need to change these o-rings let's assemble all the parts we need to change all o-rings in here Assemble the pneumatic head properly and skew the screws. We have done with the assimilation of the numeric head. After that, we need to assemble this small part to this hole and skew this part.
change the felt and be careful with the sides of the felt and squeeze the screw in the top. And now we are replacing the other felt. Again, we need to be careful about the size of the felt and assemble the other parts and squeeze it well. We have changed the all the felts and we have changed the all the o-rings. Be careful while you are maintaining your transfer pump. Be sure that you have changed the all o-rings. Assemble the metal pin and be careful about the side of the pin. The longer side will be in the bottom. and plug in the small pin to fix the parts. The bigger spring will be assembly here to fix the pin. We have assembled the old felts inside of the pump and we have changed the o-ring in here. Assemble the metal pin like this. Now we are assembling the cover of the numeric part. And now we will assemble the throat seals. Be careful about the side of the throat seals. It's really important and assemble them as I show. After that, assemble the bolt of the throat seals and squeeze it.
and we will assemble the numeric piston. Be careful about the side. The holes will be in the bottom side. And put the, the protection spring of the numeric piston. And we will assemble the pneumatic head. Be careful about the holes. We will uh, fix the pneumatic head to the system with a metal pin. And we will fix the pneumatic head to the pneumatic piston with the help of two metal pin. And we will lubricate the pneumatic place. And assemble the pneumatic system's hive as shown and squeeze it. And finally, we will assemble the material hive of the pump to the bottom. And we have done with the whole assemblation. I hope this video helps to you while maintaining your transfer pumps. Thank you for watching.